Today we are breaking up the bloodline and each of them have one year to get as many championships as possible. Jimmy Uso will be going for the US title. Jay Uso for the Intercontinental title. Solo will be chasing the coveted 24-7 title. Sami Zayn is actually going to be going for the WWE title. And Roman Reigns will be chasing the big gold belt. Let's do it. Kicking it off with our first pay-per-view money in the bank. Will any bloodline members walk away with titles tonight? Let's find out. Oh, John Cena retains the WWE Championship over Sami Zayn. Truth beats Solo Sokoa to retain the 24-7 title. All right, we are 0 for 2. Gunther retains the Intercontinental Championship. 0 for 3. Oh, there we go. Jimmy Uso captures the United States Championship from Austin Theory. But what about Roman? Roman Reigns does not defeat Brock Lesnar for the big gold. So Jimmy Uso scores first with a U.S. title win. Let's go. On to our next pay-per-view, WrestleMania Backlash. Ah, our truth is going to be giving another 24-7 title shot to Solo Sokoa. That's why we love our truth But Solo might be the only former Bloodline member on the card. No way. We are running back Reigns and Lesnar for the World Heavyweight title. And Sami Zayn's in the main event against John Cena. Okay, so just the Usos did not have an appearance on this show. Can Solo capture his first title? He does! Solo Sokoa defeats our truth to become... 24-7 champion. What about the tribal chief? What about Roman Reigns? The new world heavyweight champion. That big gold looks pretty cool on Roman, I gotta say. But what about our main event? What about our honorary oos? Bam! Oh, he did it! Sami Zayn! The new WWE champion, which means every former Bloodline member is now on the board except for Jey Uso. Now that they're all split up, they're all trying to cement themselves as legends in the business. But it's important to remember there's a big difference between legends and Raid Shadow Legends transition. <laughs> Today's video is brought to you guys by the infamous Raid Shadow Legends, now featuring Ronda Rousey. What? Raid Shadow Legends is one of the most popular mobile games in the world, period. It's completely free to play. The graphics are insane, on par with PC and console games. There are over 650 unique champions to add to your collection and endless customization. And whether you're a casual or competitive player, Raid Shadow Legends has something for everybody. And right now you can get pro wrestling superstar Ronda Ronda Rousey for free. That's pretty cool. You guys know I love a good wrestling crossover. Her moveset is wild, too. She's got these crazy fists of fire and a bunch of multi-hit skills. She's an absolute badass that can fit any team. All you gotta do is log in and play Raid for seven days between now and February 20th, and Ronda is yours for free. To celebrate Ronda's arrival in Raid, you can also use the promo code RAIDRONDA for some special in-game gifts. Also, if you're an Amazon Prime member, you can get more exclusive rewards in Raid right now. Now. So go ahead and click that link down in the description or scan the QR code on your screen to download Raid. New players get $30 worth of in-game bonuses like an XP boost, 200,000 silver, one ancient shard, one energy refill, and an awesome new champion. These bonuses can be redeemed right here in your inbox, so do not miss out. Thank you once again to Raid, a longtime sponsor, and we greatly appreciate it. Without further ado, let's get back to it. On to Extreme Rules. Don't give up hope, Jay. See? What did I say? You're getting an Intercontinental title shot. By the way, Rey Mysterio is now the Intercontinental champion? When did that happen? Oh, this is a big night because Solo's defending the 24-7 title. Jimmy's defending the U.S. title. Roman's defending the world title. And Sammy's defending the WWE title. Let's start with Jay. You need this the most, man. Let's go! Oh, Jason. Solo retains the 24-7 title. Let's go. Oh, Jimmy Uso lost the United States title already. That's sucks. What about Roman? Did Roman retain? He did. World heavyweight title stays around the tribal chief's waist. And in the main event, Sami Zayn able to retain the WWE title. Good for him. On to the biggest event of the summer. Roman and Swiss. Roman retains again. Solo retains again. Jay has lost again. <laughs> Jimmy cannot recapture the US title. And finally, Sami Zayn retains again. Wow. Roman went to war with his enemy, but came out the victor and has defended the world championship. This heated matchup has shown how important this title is to both rivals, but tonight the champion stands tall with the gold. To payback we go. Some of the bloodline are on a hot streak and some of them 
not so much. But, Jay, you're getting another shot. I don't know who you know that you keep getting shots like this, but congratulations. Oh, triple threat 24-7 title. Damn. Might be difficult for Solo Sokoa to hang on to that. Sammy's defending against Ke They're obviously in a crazy rivalry right now. Jimmy's getting another title shot. You guys got some connections, huh? Roman will defend again against Swiss. And I think that's it, right? Yeah, okay. All right, let's run it. Fingers crossed for Jay Uso. Bam! <laughs> I can't help you, man. I can't. All right, what about the triple threat? Wha-bam. Oh, Ciampa wins the 24-7 title in the triple threat. Solo Sokoa no longer champ. Damn. Speaking of good runs, Sami Zayn has been whooping Kevin Owens' ass from here to Albuquerque. Oh, Jimmy can't pick it. J you guys are running out of chances. I'm gonna be honest with you. Roman, however, remains on top, proving why he is the big dog. Moving forward to Clash of Champions. I assume all titles are going to be on the line once again. Yes, Sami Zayn defended against John Cena. Ooh, that's going to be a tough one. Sola Sokoa puts the 24-7 title on the line against Johnny Gargano. Jimmy gets yet another shot at the U.S. title against Riddle. Oh, check this out. Triple threat intercontinental title. Jay has a chance here. A lot of chaos going on in these ladder matches. He could just scoop up and... Oh, Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins for the big gold. That's going to be crazy. All right, let's start off with this opening contest. Sami Zayn retains. This is a run of a lifetime for the honorary Oos. I wonder if he's still Oosie Oos since they broke up. I'll say, yeah, I'll let it. I'll let it happen. Wait, I thought Ciampa won the title. No, whatever. Solo's got it. <laughs> Damn, Jimmy, James, Jimothy. This is not working out. Oh, Rey Mysterio retains Jay again. Another chance. Slipping through your fingertips. And Roman Reigns beats Seth Rollins to retain the big gold once again. This man's crazy. Wait. Why does it say in the news that Jay has won the Intercontinental Championship? This literally says that Ray won the championship. But like the names, hmm. Because the names don't match up with the pictures. Does that have something to do with it? Is Jay actually the champion? Yeah, he's the Intercontinental Champion. Congrats, I guess. Okay, so finally... Jey Uso is apparently on the board with one Intercontinental Championship win. So as of now, everybody in the bloodline is a one-time champion. Because Solo actually didn't lose it to Ciampa, I guess. Let's go with that. Hell in a Cell pay-per-view and Sammy's up against John Cena inside Hell in a Cell. Good luck, brother. Jimmy, I don't know how you're pulling this off, man, but congrats to you. Oh, here we go. Solo and Ciampa in a 24-7 Hell in a Cell match. Jey Uso's defending his newly won, allegedly, Intercontinental Championship against Big E. I'll take it. Wow. Main event Hell in a Cell. Roman Reigns versus Randy Orton for the World Heavyweight title. Damn. Let's check these results. Bam, Sami Zayn retains, you already know. What a run. Jimmy loses again. You need to take a break, sir. Solo Sokoa still 24-7 champion, undisputed. Oh my God, you lost it already, Jason. I need to see this main event though. The main event results, Randy Orton defeats Roman Reigns inside of Hell in a Cell and is the new World Heavyweight Champion. Two Bloodline members lose their titles at Hell in a Cell. You hate to see it. On to Survivor Series, and we have yet to crown a two-time champion. So who's going to be the first to do that? Sammy and Kevin reigniting their rivalry. All right. Solo versus Happy Corbin for the 24-7 title. Wow, it looks like Jimmy Uso's luck may have run out because he is not getting another U.S. title shot. Jay's going to try to get his IC title back. Maybe he'll be the first one to be a two-time champion. What a story that would be. Randy and Roman running it back for the world title. And I think that's it. All right, Sammy, what you got? Oh, finally, Sami Zayn loses the WWE title to Kevin Owens. Wow. How are the other Bloodline members going to fare? Solo retains again. This man is dominant. Jay unable to recapture the IC title. That means if Roman wins, if Roman wins, he's going to be the first ever two-time champion. What do we got? Oh, Randy retains, defeating Roman Reigns. Still no two-time champions in the bloodline. Damn. Tables, ladders, and chairs await. Oh, Roman might be in trouble here because he's not getting another rematch. Jimmy Uso's back in the running. Solo's defending again. Jay's getting another chance. Oh, but Sammy is not. 
that sucks. Is Jimmy gonna be our first two-time champion? No, he is not. Oh, but Solo finally actually loses the 24-7 title. This time to Dexter Loomis. What a crazy freak of nature. Jay Uso falls short again. KO retains the title. And Roman at least beats Cesaro. Okay, still no two-time champ. Okay. To the Royal Rumble we go. The road to WrestleMania has officially begun. Solo's getting a rematch. Sammy's getting a title shot. Roman's getting a title shot. Wait, why are you with him? Kill spot. Yo, broken up. That's the whole point of the video. And then, of course, there's the 30-man Royal Rumble, which happens in the middle of the show. Okay. All right, Rumble results time. Solo Sikoa cannot recapture the 24-7 title. Sami Zayn cannot recapture the WWE title. But Roman Reigns defeats Randy Orton, becoming a two-time world heavyweight champion here. So Roman now sits alone atop the leaderboard as the only Bloodline member to get two title wins. But with WrestleMania right around the corner, we move to Elimination Chamber, and the Bloodline's running out of time to catch up. What is this? Six-man chamber match, no title on the the line though okay solo has another chance jimmy's in a random triple threat with logan paul and eric <laughs> and jay is in the main event with again no title on the line Alrighty. so the only title match here tonight is actually solo getting his rematch and he cannot pick up the win you got two shows left to try to beat the tribal chief come on guys i believe in you sammy damn it solo you got a chance oh snap Jimmy versus Jay? Rivalry match? The bloodline has imploded. And Roman Reigns putting the title on the line against John Cena. Who knows what's going to happen there? First up, Solo. Come on. Get it back. No, he doesn't. He can't do it. How about the Usos? Jimmy Uso beats Jay in the brother versus brother match. No title was on the line, though. So not a whole lot of implications in that one. But Roman retains again as if anybody's surprised. All right, Bloodline, this is it. Going into WrestleMania, Roman Reigns is the only two-time champion. Everyone only won their titles once. Can anybody tie this game up? Well, it won't be Jimmy because he's not getting another U.S. title shot. <laughs> it could be Solo. Solo could tie Roman. Wow, these guys said we don't give a damn about titles. We just want to beat the sh out of each other. I respect it. Whoa, Steel Cage, Roman Reigns versus Demon Finn Balor for the world title. And in the main event of WrestleMania, Edge, Sami Zayn, and Drew McIntyre for the WWE title. Let's go. Can Solo Sikoa tie Roman Reigns and become a two-time champion? He did it! Solo recaptures the 24-7 title at WrestleMania over Dexter Loomis. Jimmy Uso picks up another win over his brother. He's 2-0. Damn, sucks to suck. But for the World Heavyweight title, Demon Balor dethrones Roman Reigns at WrestleMania. Yikes. It's up to Sami Zayn. Can Sami become a two-time WWE Champion in the main event of WrestleMania. He does! Wait. Wait, does he? Because his name, because it's on the name, but it's on Edge. Because it's on his name, but the but the picture is Edge. We need to check. It doesn't say anything about Sami winning the title. Okay, well, there's one way for us to find out if Sami Zayn actually is the champion. And he's not. He's not. I knew it. The game's broke. Whatever. <laughs> Roman Reigns and Solo Sokoa have won the whole damn thing. The only two-time champs in the bloodline. Honorable mention, of course, to the honorary Us because Sammy had a hell of a WWE title run there for a while. Usos, though, they'll probably stick to tag team action. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. Thank you guys for stopping by. Hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Oh, watch this one, too. All right.